How to Sell Notion Templates on Gumroad Hello guys and welcome back to today's video. In today's video, I'm going to teach you how you could sell your very own Notion templates that you have created on your own in Gumroad. Now the Notion templates are going to be technically an online item or a digital download so you will be able to start selling it on Gumroad. Now Notion has a lot of potential and you could build amazing templates with it. So a lot of people in the internet are actually buying different types of templates for Notion. And you will be able to do that as well on your own. If you don't know, Notion is like a note app but with more functionality. As you can see when I press on the slash, you will be able to add a lot of different features such as uh, quotes, divider, toggle list, number list, tables, and many more. It seems plain and simple enough, but as you scroll down, you will be able to see so many things that you could use to build an am amazing template. You could add videos, audios, image, you could even have AI. As you can see here, you could ask AI to create a simple description on how someone could earn money by selling Notion templates. You see, then I could simply click on enter and the AI will actually write it as you can see. And already, one of its one way to earn money is by creating a high quality templates for specific use. So that is already an idea on what you should do for your templates. Now, creating a template is not going to be easy. Of course, it might take a while specifically for creating a specific item for a specific type of category. For example, you would like to create a category for a computer science. So you will have to build an amazing template that will involve everything a computer science student or a computer science worker should need. So it's not going to be easy, but anyway, that is how you will be able to do it. You will be able to do it over here on the left side. As you can see, simply add a page and then simply do whatever you need. Maybe for example, let's say this page is for navigation. Something like that. Then you can use the slash. Then you can search on the page. And let's say this page is for coding tasks. Something like that. And then this is... Uh, let's add some blue list over here, something like that. And let's say code project one. Then you could do whatever you would like for that. Then you could add some uh, notes if you need. So, for example, you would require the project number one to have consist of all the information the client is asking or whatever. You could utilize all of this feature that you are seeing right now. To build a good feature or a good place to find different information that you could have some toggle list over here that you could have as well and let's say continue writing there we go then you could continue writing again uh i guess you could add that anymore that uh you have this toggle ai now so when you toggle this it will move as well uh continue writing you could ask the AI to help you build your output as well. You don't really need to uh, make it too hard for yourself. Notion comes with an AI, so make sure that you utilize that as much as possible to help build your output over here. But assuming that's done, we could go back to navigation. And as you can see, we now have this part over here. I could now change this to another emoji. So let's say computer. And let's select a computer over here. Maybe this one. There you go. Now we have this. Wherein if they select this, they will be redirected to another page. And we can open in a side peek. There we go. Then you get the idea on how you will be able to build it. There's a lot of potential in Notion, of course. Because a lot of people are indeed using it in a lot of different ways. They could use it for personal, for team management, and many more. And you could also come in the thread and do the same thing. And you could also check out the different templates already existing in Notion to give you an idea at least. For example, the to-do list over here. Someone already made this as you can see. You have an all task. 
you have other versions over here if you click on get template we will be able to have this you have the project task over here as well a lot of people are very creative so i suggest that you are or you are to be creative as well and make a very high quality output to ensure that your output or your template will have a lot of visibility or a lot of people will notice your template for its uniqueness and let's check out one more example over here for example we have the open rural tracker. as you can see there's a lot of things that you can see here and it's a very useful platform so assuming that you have built your template already and you have an amazing template that you are now ready to sell what you're going to do next is you're going to click on share over here at the top to publish it to the web as you can see click on publish and publish to the web and as you can see here now this page is live on the web so you can't really do anything about other people viewing it but you could have it as a link expire but this one is for uh, plus version so you would need to upgrade it so let's say uh, we enable the expire so you would need to get this as well of course but uh, let me explain how you would do it you will enable the expire make it as the shortest time possible and when you're starting to sell it on gumroad mention that in the description after you buy this project immediately duplicate it as a top template as you can see here they have this option over here duplicate as template and you could allow editing comments and all of those stuff so after you sell it they will be able to receive the link they will click on view site and once they view it what they're going to do is they're going to have to duplicate it as a template so there will be an option over here as you can see duplicate over here on the top right they click on duplicate you will be able to duplicate the template that you have created into their own notion so over here on gumroad what you're going to do is to go to your products new products click on new products over here click on digital product because this is a digital product uh let's name this notion template uh, click on next price of product let's say ten dollars for now next customize and as you can see here description put in the description that i am talking about then you have your url upload some covers you could create covers in canva if you want then you could upload the file over here now what you're going to do is you're going to either have a notepad or a note file that you should upload over here and but this is a thumbnail so this is not really what you're going to need to but uh where is it let's scroll down versions variations uh let's save and continue for now and this is the content over here simply upload or paste the url that you have for example this is our url simply paste it over here and this is the content that they will be able to receive after they buy it so simply or rather this is the actually this is the description or rather, this is the content that you want to sell this is where you will upload it or this is where you're going to type it so paste the code over here or the url and publish and continue and now that's basically it so once they buy the product but of course i suggest that you fill it in with the necessary information but once they buy the product they will be able to access the link and they will be able to see your url then they will be able to duplicate the topic and that's basically the process very simple and very direct and so that's it guys so if you enjoyed this video please consider leaving a like and subscribe thanks for watching